Yeah, so um, I don't have an intro no more, so just make sure you guys like the video, subscribe, you know. What is that? Y'all hear that? It's getting louder too. Get it. What is up, man? Your boy Malin got your big gun, silly dogs, man. <laughs> hey, man. But look, as you can see by the title, man, we coming with y'all with a story time. Bro, I've been, bro, I did a story time like years ago, bro. But I never did this one because of the simple fact that. The person didn't want me to do it, but I don't rock with him no more. So yeah, <laughs> you know, I don't get no fuck, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so hey, it's the first time, I, I, as you can see by the title, this is the first time your wedding got some. <laughs> Slid up, you feel me, you know what I'm saying? So <laughs> that's what the story time gonna be about, basically. So let me go and get my drink, you know what I'm saying? Cause yeah, that good dirty dirty, you know what I'm saying? Cause it's finna get real juicy, you know what I'm saying? But listen though, before we go and get started in this video, make sure you guys leave a thumbs up, man. Like, subscribe. If you have never seen my face before, if you just coming across this video, like, let me check this shit out real quick. Make sure you subscribe, man, you know what I'm saying? Just go and get to 3,000 subscribers. I'm at 2.5 right now. Let me tell you how me and this girl met, because I don't want it to be a short story, you know what I'm saying, you feel me? So this is ninth grade. I know, I have good memory, but this is ninth grade. This is like first semester, bro. Met this girl, you know what I'm saying? She wasn't rocking that first though. Let me go and just put that out there, right out there. That's crazy. A girl that wasn't rocking with you end up giving you slop. That's just snap it up for you, boy. Snap it up. So I'm just like, all right, okay. Well, she she not rocking, so I'm just going cool. I'm cooling it. So then like in the class, she started getting more talkative, like just talking to me. I'm like, all right, but yeah. So this is prom mouse. This is prom social media mouse. Because real life mouse, bro, I was just, uh, bro, <laughs> I was just, I was ass. I don't know what I was wearing in school, bro. What else? I was a little boy, bro. I wasn't really thinking about none of that, bro. I was just trying to enjoy life at the time. Just a regular kid, bro. But I was going crazy on Instagram, though. I think I had like 15K on Instagram. Got like 3,000, 4,000 uh, likes on my photos and stuff like that, bro. I had a lot of things coming, bro. Like, I, that was prom time mouse for social media. I found her Instagram. Hey, she had like a cool 30. Actually, she had, I think she had more than me, but I ended up surpassing her like along the way, you know. That, that's just your boy, you know what I'm saying? She found my Instagram and then we just started becoming like best friends. I ain't have her number yet though, but I don't think I ever had her snap. No, I had her number. But we didn't text though. So we became best friends. Don't know how. I just, that's the only thing. That's the only part I remember. I don't remember how we became best friends. I really don't. I started walking her to class every single day. We used to meet at this little circle and I used to walk her from there to class every single day. But if, she, if I miss one day out, she would be super mad. I watched her to class every single day, but then each day you could tell like more feelings was being, I knew she liked me, but I just waiting for her to admit it because like, come on, you, you, you got me walking her to class. First we were just walking side by side, you know, me just side by side. Then she started coming up under my arm. You know, people was noticing us. Okay, now I see y'all. Hey, you know me, man. You know what the fuck going on. <laughs> you know me, you know, you know what I'm saying? But all this aside though, I was really nervous, bro. I thought, bro, when I tell you ninth grade, I was so insecure, bro. Cause like, bro, I was just, I don't know, but I know how to join and stuff like that. But I was just, uh, deep down inside, I was insecure, bro. So my main fear was somebody just being like, ugh, why you with that ugly? Like, you know, I was so, bro, I was so, like, I was so insecure. That was my only fear, bro. Man, I just knew it was coming, bro. I think it came one time. So I was like, boy, dude. like, bro, that was just, Baking me, bro. But I can't blame myself. But my outfits was so trash, bro. I was just ugh, ass person, bro. So look, like I said, we started we started side by side. Then we started up under the arms. Then she started talking about some give me a kiss before I leave and stuff. I'm like, all right, come on, bro. Now you're doing too much. Now you're like, that's when I knew for sure. Yeah, this girl likes me, bro. So then, but I don't know though because I was trying to lean in to give her a kiss and she was like, ah, I'm just playing. I was like, all right, cool, bro. She kind of got me low key shitty, but but I was really chilling. Fast forward, we started FaceTime and stuff, but it wasn't nothing too serious. Like, it wasn't nothing too serious. A whole semester we was talking. A whole semester. A whole semester we was best friends. Like, this wasn't just no changing. This wasn't just no couple months type thing. It was a whole semester of her just walking her to class every single day. Like, like I said, she dubbed me. I still had, I still thought she was cute. She said, if she wanted to rock me at any moment, I would say yes. Like, I'm not like, hey, she was cute though. Next semester, we chilling and stuff. I started, no, summertime. Hold up, now I'm confused. 
I think this was ninth grade, second semester. Because in the summertime, I used to go, I used to go over her house and stuff. That's when it got like, yeah, woo. So summertime, okay, okay. So I think everything I just, everything I just said before, that was second semester of ninth grade. Second semester of ninth grade had to be because I went over her house in the summertime. I don't know honestly, but I went over her house in the summertime. Freaked out, bro. Like had on a robe. They had nothing up under it. What else? Asked me to give her a booty rug, bro. I'm talking about like, bro, I felt like I was just that nigga, bro. You feel like, like that's what how she made me felt, bro. Oh, bro, I was just a little kid, bro. Like, I was just a little kid, bro. Like, I didn't know what to do. She was laying on top of me, bro. I was just chilling, bro. So then, uh, fast forward. We started, we started doing stuff like going to McDonald's, sitting down, eating together and stuff like that. So then, one of her friends came to me one day and was like, uh, basically saying like, you know, what's like, um, like what, what you and her got going on? I'm like, we ain't got nothing going on. We just chilling. Like she already dubbed me, so like I'm not finna try that again and get dubbed over and over again. That's dead. Like I'm not doing that shit. So then she was like, no, nah, I think she like you, bro. Like probably. Are you cool, bro. Yeah. Just ignore her, bro. So then we got on Facetime that that day that night. She's like, you told your friend I don't, I don't like you. I was like, nigga, that's what that's what you obviously did. Like when we first met. So like, fuck, I'm not finna try again. I'm not gonna lame at it. Nah, I do like you and stuff like that. So I just like. Okay, cool, you know what I'm saying? You know, me blushing and stuff, had to had to put her on pause because I'm like <laughs> I was so excited, bro. I was bro. I was just happy, bro, because like this girl was dead ass bad, bro. Like <laughs> ninth grade, bro. I wasn't doing shit, bro. I was just <laughs> chilling, bro. So to have a bad girlfriend, bro, I was so happy, bro. We started dating and stuff like that, and then of course we FaceTime every single day. Fun fact, but she had a job I didn't like, which made it the, the relationship so trash for me, bro. I couldn't buy her nothing on. I couldn't buy her nothing, bro. Nothing, bro. And then I was a little boy at the same time, so it was like it would have been better if I gave if I could have gave her some meat or something like that. But your boy mentality, I wasn't on that. I was a little kid, bro. I was just chilling, bro. But like I'm talking, about, we went to the mall. She bought me clothes, food. I didn't have to do nothing, like. I ain't even gonna lie, bro. She was the nigga in that relationship, yeah, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. She was the nigga. Bro. I know, I know, I sound out bad, bro. But she was still bad, though. Like, I still took control. Like, I was, told her to shut up when she needed to shut up, though. Told her that she needed to shut the meat when she needed to suck the meat. You know what I'm saying? So we was, still, I was still the man. You know what I'm saying? One day, she came to my house, bro. Her friend dropped her off. I don't think she had a whip. Friend dropped her off. I'm like, okay. So we come in, exact same bed, bro. I think it was turned this way, though. That was my room. I had a way smaller dresser than this. This way was, it was this way. So, my friend called me, right? My friends was in my house. I told them they got a skedaddle. You know? Got them. She come. They all leave. Jibu called me was like, cause this is the first, bruh. I was in ninth grade, bruh. So don't, don't, don't clown your boy. But this is the first time a girl has ever been on my house, bruh. So you know Jibu calling me, hey, you got a bitch over there. <laughs> you do it like that, bruh. I'm like, <laughs> As I was on the phone, bro, let me tell you how she was. As I was on the phone, I was laying, I was laying down on the bed. She, I, I'm laying down on the phone. I'm, I'm, no, I got, I got to, I got to, bro, I got to. I was laying down on the bed like this, bro. Literally, I'm talking about like I felt like I was in a, a dope boy video. Like I felt like I was gonna, young thug, for real. She climbed on top of me and just started kissing me on my neck, bro, trying to give me one of the craziest hickeys ever. At the time, bro, if somebody come anywhere right here, bro, anywhere right here, ninth grade, ninth grade, I'll be like, bro, what are you doing, bro? Like, what are you doing, bro? She's <laughs> like, yo, like, oh no, like, watch your hands, dude, like, what's up? So, I was like, huh, let me try something on her real quick. So, I ain't gonna cap. Like I told, I'm a little dude, bro. I'm keeping it fully a thousand on y'all right now. We'll drop up and stuff like that, which felt awesome at the time, bro. That, which I haven't feel so awesome, bro. Like I had her arms behind my back, just bouncing that guy on my meat, bro. bro it felt, I don't know, bro. So then she was like, "How about we take the clothes off?" And since you like acting like you going crazy, I was just like, "Chill, <laughs> chill." So then I had she had on jeans, so no, she had on leggings on top of jeans, which sounds weird. She took her she took her jeans off, and she just had on leggings. Oh my god, bro. So yeah. I started like, you know, met, I started going by her area, you know what I'm saying, her, you know, area. She didn't flinch not one time, bro, which was like really weird, bro. Like, it was, for me, I was like, I, was, I thought she was gonna jump, be like, hey, chill, what are you doing? But she did it to me, bro, I was like, ah, chill out. 
Ugh. Nigga, you gay. I was like, chill out, bro. What you doing, bro? Like, why you touching on me, bro? Like, what's up, bro? But she been... She was touching on me way before, but it was like on the outside, but she was trying to go in, bro. So I was like, so then she started getting mad. Like, what's wrong? Like, am I ugly or something? I'm like, chill, bro. I'm just, just a little ass kid, basically. She's like, all right, I get it. So you just want me to take in truck. <laughs> do what you do, you know? <laughs> do what you do. Bed was this way, right? This part, look. This part was this way. So I was like this. I was just like this. She was so short and I was so tall. She was standing up. I, like I told you, she was standing up, bruh. Oh, bruh. Just imagine getting slobbed right there, just like that. Put it out, bruh. I heard grab one of my pillows, felt so weird, bruh. All I felt was my meat just being wiggled around a thousand times, bruh. Next thing you know, my shit was like this, bruh. She started going crazy. I put a pillow over my head the entire time, bruh. I was just like, Dang, she's going nuts, bro. She's going nuts, bro. At the time, bro, I think my nut was my nigga. My my semen was still probably like clear, gray. Fast forward, you know, she made me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Kept it in her mouth all oh, that stuff. I don't think she swallowed, but she kept it in there, bro. Kept going, bro. I agree, you just imagine that feeling for the first time. The first time, bro. I was like, I think after, bro, I laid on the bed. I was just like, Shh. I was like, what's up, bro? What you? <laughs> I like, what's up, bro? I, I started feeling like, I, I started feeling like, like I said, I was, if I was on something, so I was just laying on the bed, like, you know, like, what's up, bro? They kiss me. I was like, hey, watch out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Watch out. You're not finna kiss me after you just suck my Peter Wacker, you feel me? So. We laid down and stuff like that. Next thing you know, it's around like four o'clock. My mom figured to come up like, you gotta go. Me and her, I walked her home and then I walked back. But that entire way back, bro, I was just like, just skipping, bro. I was just so happy, bro. After that, bro, I got on FaceTime. I was just telling how much I love her, bro. I was with, bro, after that, bro. After that, I was with. And she was like, next time, we're gonna do, you know, more sexual things. This was fast forward. New Year's, I think we broke up. Cause yeah, that girl's crazy. My mentality now, bro, that girl is crazy. And I was with, bro, I was really with, bro. Like, I have arguments and then I'll forgive her even though it'd be her fault. Like, it would just be crazy, bro. I'll never forget that story, bro. Slot was amazing, you dig? <laughs> Slap. But yeah, she went crazy. So that's the end of the story time, man. The story time was 14 minutes. I hope you guys like that, man. You know, I. I'ma try to I'm gonna try to come on with some more if y'all rock with this one. If y'all don't rock with this one, then I'm not gonna come out with no more. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? So make sure y'all guys like subscribe, man. Let me know if y'all want me to do the first time anything, bro. So bro, I got plenty more stories though. So let me know, man. And um, me, yeah, I see y'all the next time I pose you did. Slap, I'm out. Ah! No, let me do that over. I ain't like that. Alright, so I'm out, man. <laughs>